Alcohol and drug abuse are major problems on the Navajo Nation. Next week, a large new behavioral health center will open in Shiprock to help deal with those issues. News 13's Amanda Goodman was there today. This is the 14 men's bed. A residential wing. What you're looking at is a vision that took nearly 14 years and 16 million dollars to realize. This is a dream come true for a lot of people. There's a lot of people that have hit bottom. And now they can get the help they need for substance abuse and or mental health issues without ever leaving the reservation. We are going to be opening up in phases. This 56,000 square foot facility is the first of its kind in the U.S. because it's run by the Navajo Nation for the Navajo Nation. We really look at integrating the Navajo philosophy, philosophy of Hojon and um, really having those basic building um, blocks in our treatment process. With 72 beds and a staff that speaks Navajo, the Department of Behavioral Health Services believes this facility will fill an enormous need. The rural and isolation and uh, availability of resources out here is, is so limited that this, this is going to work out here and people well want to come to treatment. Everything in the center has a specific purpose. Take for example a laundry room. By having patients do their own laundry, they learn self-sufficiency. Because for the patients who come here and the specialists that treat them, this is about more than just kicking a bad habit. We really look at um, helping these individuals grow um, emotionally, mentally, spiritually and physically. A holistic approach to healing in a setting where cultural beliefs are a priority, not an afterthought. In Shiprock, Amanda Goodman, KRQE News 13. The center opens to male teens next Monday with treatment programs for men and women to follow later this year. If all goes well, the Department of Behavioral Health Services plans to open other facilities like this across the reservation in the future.